everybody welcome back to the channel and it's just a quick video really just an update on a few little bits that have turned up over the Christmas period ready for the car um, in the new year um, obviously we talked about in the last video some things that we were going to be doing um, you know dropping the hydraulic suspension in there um, and then obviously we obviously test fitted the wheels very briefly um, and found that they stuck out a little bit too far so it looks like we may have to put some wide arches on the car um, I don't think we're going to be going extremely wide, don't need to do that, but it's obviously just so that they sit snugly inside the um, arches, you know, rather than sticking out. Um, but, you know, until we get the hub adapters and everything on there, it's going to be difficult to say what we're going to need to do. I'll stick a picture of those, actually, that I've uh, we've just ordered uh, down in on the video, so you can see what I mean by the hub adapters going from 4 stud to 5 stud. I'm sure most people do understand that. Um, but uh, the wheels are obviously they are five stud one a five by one twenty, and the course is a four by one hundred. So we need to obviously adapt that. We've gone with the fifteen mil adapters. Um, I don't think we need to go anything too wide. Um, yeah, they're already uh, from what I, I I I butted them right up to the uh, the drums on the course uh, uh, without any adapters, and they were already sticking out. So by the time they've got, you know, 15 mil added onto that as well, you know, they'll obviously be even further out of the arch. Um, but anyway, yeah, there we go. Um, I'm sorry, it's a strange location for me to be filming. Uh, sat in a window. Um, it's the only place I can seem to get any peace and quiet in the house today. Uh, it's Christmas. Everybody's running and jumping all over the place. Um, so just sort of shut myself in a room and uh, hope that uh, <laughs> I can get five minutes peace to do a quick video. Um, but yeah, so th so anyway, we'll uh, I'll, sh I'll show you the video of what we've got going on, um, what I've turned up ready for the hydraulics to be installed in the new year. Nice new spinners. Obviously, these ones don't have that on at the moment. Oh, they're in the house. But yeah, proper Volt chrome spinners. Okay, so today we have received some new shocks for the Corsa. <laughs> they're new, but they're going to get butchered. Um, I probably could have bought some second-hand ones, some leaking ones, you know, everything else. But it was just quicker to get these, and they weren't that expensive anyway. So we're going to cut these up here somewhere, and then our hydraulics will be slotted down inside here, and then we'll weld around the top. That way, they've got a nice mounting point to fit what's on the Corsa at the bottom, and then the top. We'll no longer need any of this because it'll be bolted in slightly differently. Also got the rears. So again, cut it down here somewhere so the bottom end can be mounted onto the car and the top will be just rubbish. There we go. So, uh, excuse the mess in here. It's, uh, <laughs> it's Christmas and I need to tidy up in here. Uh, it's my van. I'm not going to show you it because it's a pigsty, but uh, anyway, yeah, you get the idea of why we've got these um, Hopefully we'll get some more pictures updated as we go along with that bit of build that way You know you can see exactly what's happened um, so yeah when he cuts the those Sorry I completely lost my train of thought <laughs> um, when he cuts those shocks um, and then obviously when we slot them down inside and he's welded them all up you know we should show you some pictures and images of that i'm sure um before they bolt back onto the car so you grasp a concept of what we're talking about and then obviously you'll see them when they're when they're on there um so uh, anyway there we go just a little bit of update of what's happened uh, over the christmas period well nothing's happened just what's arrived um we'll obviously um we're waiting on the hub adapters to go from four stud to five stud for the for the wheels um, and that way we can start getting some measurements in place of exactly how high we want the car to sit and everything else when it's uh, down on the hydraulics uh, before we start chopping and prepping everything to uh, fit them fully. There you go. So as we said, we'll keep those um, videos and photos coming in uh, as we start to do this build bit by bit um, so that you can follow the progress of what's going on. Um, but uh, yeah any questions um anything else like that give me a shout 
um, you know, let me know uh, if you're building a Corsa or, or anything else. It's nice to see the other Max Power builds out there. You know, obviously, a few people got in touch and, uh, you know, messaged me on Instagram to show me some of the stuff that they're doing. So that was quite cool. It's always good to meet new people, chat to people. You know, obviously, as I said in the previous video, you know, we can swap uh, swap details for uh, things that are for sale. And, and, you know, because it's not always stuff that, you you know, I'm not always just after Corsa bits. Um, you know, the spoiler that we, or one of the spoilers um, that we have possibly got going on the Corsa is from a Saxo. In fact, it wasn't. I tried to get a Saxo one, and it's actually off of a Fiesta. But uh, it's a horn spoiler from a, it's very similar to the Saxo um, and Peugeot cipher kit that CCM used to produce, I believe. So, um, yeah, we've got to try and adapt that to fit onto the Corsa. Um, so, yeah. You know, it wasn't a course apart. Um, you know, I've also got some other ideas. You know, that you know, using other bits off of different cars that we'd like to do. Um, but uh, yeah, so there we go. Um, give it us a like. Uh, you know, you know, please subscribe if you haven't. Um, you know, share the video. Um, you know, obviously it helps us boost the channel. Uh, means we can do a bit more for uh, you know for YouTube and for you guys to watch. But anyway, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.